Thank you, Tony. At this time, Mr. Keith Mason, President of Personhood USA. Hey, guys. I came here today to have my voice heard. And there's people behind me that believe that it's okay to kill a baby through abortion. There's people behind me that think that your tax dollars should pay to kill a baby through abortion. Did you come here today to have your voice heard? I didn't even, I, I couldn't hear. This is the largest march that I've ever seen in Colorado. Praise the Lord! I'm going to invite all the representatives that are here that have signed or that want to sign the personhood petition. And as they make their way to the stage, I would like you guys to repeat something that I heard earlier today. I heard a little bit of a, a saying. I think it went something like, hey ho, Roe has got to go. Hey ho, Roe has got to go. So as the politicians make their way to stage, I want you to tell them and everyone behind me that Roe has got to go and that personhood is going to be established in Colorado for every person, big or small. Can you guys do some chanting? Can you guys? Not sure if they can hear you. Okay, 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 okay. You're gonna lose your voice. You're gonna lose your voice. Now, I have a question for you. Why, why does Roe have to go? Why, why is Roe so bad? It's evil. It's evil. You know why? Because abortion is murder. Abortion is murder. Can we, do you have enough voice left to tell these politicians that abortion is murder? Abortion is? Abortion is? Murder. Abortion is? Murder. Amen. Well, I, I appreciate all these, these guys up here. It's an honor. Senator Scott Renfro, David Schulteis here, State Senator, Kevin Lundberg, Amy Stevens, BJ Nico, Tom Lucero. Thank you, Tom, for being here. Thank you, Tom. There was a gentleman, Jimmy Lakey, that said he would like to sign. Is he here today? He's running for 7th Congressional District. Jimmy Lakey, he's coming on up. If there's anyone else running for office that wants to change things and make a commitment to you and before God that they believe that every person is a person, no matter how small, welcome to come up here. And as these, these brave men and women are making a declaration before you, I want to tell you that last year's Colorado personhood effort didn't get enough votes, if you didn't know that already. It was the first one in the country, but we didn't get enough votes. But it wasn't a failure. It was a start. I just got off a plane a few hours ago from Washington, D.C. And there's hundreds of thousands of people marching, advocating for the personhood of the preborn child. There's men and women just like you that are saying, it's up to me. I'm going to do what it takes to make it happen. And they're starting personhood efforts and working on personhood efforts in their state. Mississippi is growing leaps and bounds, and they turn in the same time we do. And their lieutenant governor said, this is the first fight I want to pick with the feds. Yeah. 
I'm so encouraged, and there's reason to be encouraged. But we're not going to get on the ballot in Colorado. We're not going to get on the ballot unless you get us on the ballot. That's right. We don't have enough signatures right now. And the press conference this morning, we announced the Secretary of State made a mistake. They pushed our deadline back. We have four less days now. Oh. Convenient mistake. Yeah. We can make it on the ballot if you step up now. There's enough people here today to get all the signatures that we need. 50,000 more signatures in two weeks. If each person here could f take one petition home with them, fill it up and get it back in, one, in two weeks, we have it. We're done. Can our pre-born neighbors count on you? These guys couldn't hear that. I don't know. Can we count on you to do what it takes to affirm personhood rights and the dignity of every human person? Well then, my job is done. You can get a petition right here. There's a table amongst this sea of people right here. Look for people that are passing them out. If you leave here today without a petition, it's your fault. But if you do, call us. Call up any office that's working on the personal effort. Colorado Right to Life, person in Colorado. Get it done. We're not going to do it without you. Praise the Lord. We did it last year. We can do it again, but with your help. Amen. Thank you, guys, so much.